Hey, welcome back guys. So today on this video, we're talking about your PayPal app and more specifically, I'm going to quickly answer a question. I keep getting a lot on my other video and that is how do you turn on face ID for your PayPal app? So let's go ahead and talk about this. First off guys, real quick video, not too many steps involved. So be sure to stick around to the end of the video. But why would you wanna turn on Face ID for your PayPal app anyways? Well, that's pretty easy. If you're running a business, you might have a lot of people coming and going and you don't want someone to accidentally get access to your PayPal app. Whatever the case is, it's a pretty easy process. It's handled here in your PayPal app. It's this blue and white one here on the top center. Check my video description. I'll try to leave the written instructions there as well, but I'm gonna go ahead and open up my PayPal app now. Okay guys, I went ahead and opened my PayPal app. This is the home screen. Now here on the home screen, if you wanna turn on your face ID for your PayPal app, you need to click on your profile icon here on the top right. Once you click there, you will see a drop down menu and you wanna look for this line right here called login and security. All right, so once you click there, you're gonna see a few different options, but you wanna look for this line right here called face ID. You can see my button is gray and white. That means that it's turned off. So in order to turn on face ID for your PayPal app, just scroll that button over. Okay, now it's asking me to verify my face ID to turn this on. All right, I verified. Okay, a quick second later, the page refreshes. You can see face ID added. So the next time that I go to log in to my PayPal app, I will be required to use my face ID. So there you have it, guys. If you're wondering how to turn on your face ID for your PayPal app, that's the easiest way I know how to do it. If you know an easier way, be sure to leave a comment below. Let the rest of us know how you did it. Hopefully you found that video useful. If so, click thumbs up or maybe consider subscribing to my channel and I hope to see you on the next video. Thanks again for watching.